Good day everyone. For today's video, our topic is all about the pattern area. Pag sinasabi natin pattern area, anong ibig sabihin yan? Ah, when I say pattern area, that is a part which lies within an area surrounded by a pipeline in which are found the core deltas, and other ridges pertaining to a particular fingerprint pattern. So in short, kasi tapos naman tayo nag discuss ng type lines, what is being surrounded by the type line is a pattern area na kung saan doon natin makikita yung core, gitna, deltas, yung tagilira ng fingerprint, and other ridges. When we talk about other ridges, ito po yung ridge characteristics. Marami yan, yung mga ridge characteristics of fingerprint, which can be found in a pattern area. Take a look of this example. Ito, titingnan natin. So, let's go back to the type line. The rule says, look for the two innermost ridges that tend to surround or surround the pattern area when ends outer ridge as continuation and last rule, when bifurcates, the outside bifurcation is considered as a continuation. Bakit kailangan natin una malalaman si type line? Because that will be our basis in determining the pattern area. Hmm. Just like this one. Ito po. Hmm. Ito. So, dito, nakikita na natin ngayon yung type aha, lines. Yan. Ito. Ito na yung type lines. Mark A and B or the type line 1 and type line 2. So, inside of this, ito. Dito tayo sa next example. Okay? This will be our type line. Type line 1. And we have here the type line 2. So, yung nasa loob, itong nasa loob, ito. Ito. Itong nasa loob, yun po yung pattern area. Dito natin, makikita yung core, yung sa gitna, later on, will be determining that one. The delta, what is inside uh, the side of the fingerprint. Bakit kailangan natin ma-determine si pattern area? Because in fingerprint or in examination of fingerprint, pattern area is the subject of our examination. Ito yung area na kung saan dito natin i-examine yung fingerprint natin. Na kung saan dito natin makikita yung mga characteristics that makes fingerprint unique from other fingerprint. Dito natin makikita yung iba't ibang characteristics. Dito natin makikita yung core Dito natin makikita yung delta. And, again, as I said, this is the subject of our examination when we examine the finger print. Yan pa. Okay. On the next example, ito pa. Kung titingnan natin, this is a real fingerprint. In a loop pattern, yon. Uh, kung titingnan mo, oops, kamo na ha. Okay. Okay, ta. Kung titingnan mo, the one that is being marked as red, ito. Itong area ito. Ito na area. Uh, type line yan. Yung nasa loob dyan, itong nasa loob, ito. Ito. Ito yung pattern area. 
So pag nag examine tayo ng fingerprint, we will not be locking any prints, the foros and ridges outside the pattern area because that is not the subject of our examination. In examining fingerprints, at saka ito. Ito pa. Hmm. Yan. Yung area na yan, yun lang po yung ating isa subject for examination in examining fingerprints. Kung saan makikita natin yung different ridge characteristics na kung saan we will able to determine the individuality of fingerprints of each individual. That is the importance of determining first the pattern area in order to narrow down rather the examination of fingerprints. Yun lang po yung ating discussion for this day. Thank you.